In this video, you will learn about sari culture. Silk is a fabric with an attractive luster and drape called queen of fibers. It is used not only to make beautiful clothing but also for upholstery and soft furnishings such as curtains, cushions and wall coverings. Silk is produced naturally by the larvae of silk moth. The best variety of silk is produced from the larva of the silk moth called Bombyx mori. The practice of rearing silk on a large scale is called sericulture. Sericulture starts with laying of eggs by the silk moth. The adult yellowish white female moth lays pinhead sized slightly yellowish eggs on a special paper set out by the silk farmer. The eggs are uniformly spread on an egg farm and then covered with tissue paper and an outer frame. These frames are kept in an incubation chamber for about 20 days where they hatch due to the warmth. After 20 days, egg frames are taken out, kept on a tray. In these 20 days, eggs hatch into about half a centimeter long black larva. These egg frames having larvae on them are then covered with fresh mulberry leaves by the silk farmer. The larvae are fed on the leaves of mulberry trees day and night for 4 to 6 weeks and grow into an adult larvae after approximately 6 weeks. The adult larvae stops feeding. Farmers transfer these larvae to mountages. Each larvae then produces a single continuous silken thread and wraps the thread around itself to form a protective case called a cocoon. The cocoon forming completes in 3 days. The larvae first changes into a pupa and then into an adult silk moth which breaks the thread of the silk cocoon and comes out of it. Since the silk thread of the cocoons is damaging by the silk moth while coming out, silk farmers usually kill them by putting 10 days old cocoons into hot water. The hot water also loosens the long silken threads of the cocoons. Loosened threads from several cocoons are then wound into yarns to make strong thread which are woven into cloth. In this video, you have learned the following steps. Laying of eggs by silk moth, hatching of eggs into larvae, formation of adult larvae, formation of cocoons, extraction of silk threads. Thank you for watching.